Alright, hello and welcome back everyone. Happy Monday, and welcome to the, I believe, um, the 10th episode, yes, the 10th episode of The Old World is Gone. Dead. Whichever. Uh, so happy Monday, yeah, yeah. All you people going back to work, fun, fun. Um... So, right now, I am uh, flattening out a large tract of land. Uh, sadly, it's going to take quite some time. Uh, but essentially, all of the stuff inside of these lines here is going to be completely flat uh, up to that line. You can sort of see, like over here, it's already done. So you see how it's just completely flat, and it's adding all this dirt in. I have to keep giving it more. Oh. Stop, because there's a pig here. There we go. Now it stopped because it's out of dirt. Probably. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. It's out of dirt. I have a lot of dirt on me. Hooray. Alright. Let's fill this thing back up. So, what am I doing? I am... Actually, I'm doing a couple of things. One, uh, I want to get into uh, tracks and trains and rails and all the stuff that uh, wonderful, wonderful railcraft gives us. Uh, yeah, okay, it's going pretty well. So, part of this episode will be uh, laying some rails uh, all the way from the base uh, to out here. Um, at least laying the track. I have some of the track done, not all of it, but I have some of the track done. So, that shouldn't be too terrible. Uh, I'm just trying to wait until this thing finishes because I don't want to uh, uncompress a lot of dirt and then have to recompress it because it's super annoying um, but I also realize that this is going to take massive massive amounts of uh, oh wait actually I think it's done oh sweet okay and if I'm correct it should now be Yeah. So eventually it stops, um, yep, it has stopped using dirt, which means it is now clearing away. Oops. Help it out a little bit here. It should be clearing away the top layer. Oh, I heard it. Oh, that's right. It starts at the bottom and goes up. That's right. That's right. Okay. Cool. So I, uh, yeah, I have magnet mode on. That's why. So I have all the stuff uh, flying towards me. I'm just going to help it out a little bit here. So now, um, essentially what the filler does, you can do it to do, you can, uh, you can do it, you can tell it to do a couple of different patterns. Right now I'm using one called flatten. Flatten. Which, uh, essentially says, okay, take all of this dirt that I have here, or this, you know, land, whatever it is, and I want to... Flatten it. I want to make it all the same level, and I want it to be one block below this, essentially. So this is, um, you know, technically this is one block higher than anything else, right? So that's what it says. And then it starts from, I don't know how it picks the corner, it just sort of picks a corner and just goes from there. And so it will slowly, slowly, because I'm not feeding it a whole lot of power, I don't have, um, uh, I only have four industrial steam engines on it. So it's not going to be super fast, but uh, it'll get done, okay. I just wanted to make sure that I'm not... Yeah, I sort of had to fill the river in. It's not... Sadly, you can't, like, really map out, okay, you know, like, make sure there's still a river here. I mean, I can always go back through and just sort of... Well, yeah, I'd rather not. See, what happened here? 
So I'm going to have to fix this too, because this just looks terrible. I'll have to fill that back in. Ah, crap. Well, oh well, whatever. Alright, so let's head back to base. But yeah, essentially, I'm, I'm building a rail system because, oh, flying back and forth just takes so long. Uh, and, uh, honestly, I'm, I'm, <laughs> uh, I actually ran out of, um, of coal for a little while, so I had to ration my, uh, uh, I had to ration my, uh, my Essentia a little bit. Um, oh, it was terrible. Oh, was it ever terrible. Uh, this is already compressed. Dirt, dirt, dirt. 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 Alright. Good enough for me. Uh, let's see, how much dirt do I have? A hundred and... Whoa, okay. So I could probably go back and... Uh, tell this to craft a whole bunch of quadruple compressed dirt. Just to sort of give it something to do. Okay. And I probably have lots of cobble as well. Whoops, let me do this. Uh, whoa. How am I out of co Oh, no, I'm not out of cobble. I just have it really compressed. Okay, that's what happened. I forgot, cobble goes up to, like, seven or eight times or something. It's ridiculous. So I just compressed a whole bunch of it down. Okay. Uh, dirt. What about sand? Sand, I'm okay on. Um, what else? Gravel, right? Gravel, wow. Okay. Yeah, gravel only goes up to two. So, I'm doing okay. Dirt is really what I'm... Wow, how do I have so much dirt? That's always my question. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, no, is it crafting... One double compress, one triple compress, nine double. Uh oh. Compressed with nine dirt. Nine compressed, one double compressed. One compressed, nine compressed. What? Hold on. Nine double compressed with one triple. Oh, okay. Hold on. I think I have to, um, hold on. Let me clear that. I think I have to do the up first. Um, one double with nine. Okay. Well, let me switch these around. One triple with nine double. One triple with nine double. Okay. Now let me try that oh, again. Okay. Should see some sort of movement. Oh, no, what? No, 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 what happened? What broke? What changed? No one else is on the server at the moment. That's odd. Alright, well, let's just make a whole bunch of double for now. I can always bump it up. No, what? Odd. Let me take this down. Okay, turn this back off. Dirt. Okay, there we go. Alright, I'll let that run. 
Now it is important to note that uh, if you do stuff like that, if you do a whole bunch of uh, compressed stuff, it's going to take up a lot of your uh, crafting stuff. Like, don't expect it to auto-craft other stuff while it's doing that, because it's sort of busy. Okay. Um, let's see, let's see. Rails, 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 rails. So with Railcraft, uh, uh, it's track, actually. They call it track in the game for some reason. So there are two basic tracks. Uh, you have track and you have booster track, which is essentially your powered rail. That's what um, uh, gives you speed, increases your speed. Uh, but thanks to Railcraft, we have all of the rest of this awesome stuff. Oh, it's so fantastic. So Railcraft adds uh, three other types of track. It adds wooden track, reinforced track, and high speed track, HS track. Um, oh, oh, they upped this more than twice as. F oh, excellent. So this is really good if you're doing straightaways, um, cause you just you burn so quick. It's ridiculously fast. Seriously, it is. Um, I I actually cannot show you on the server. I was testing this earlier. I cannot show you on the server because I lag too much. That's how fast it is. Um. So if I get, uh, maybe I'll cut in some single player footage and just show you how ridiculously fast this thing is. Um, let's see what else. Uh, launcher track, this uh, launches, like actually it, it pops up. So it like lifts the cart off the track uh, pretty well. Like it, it goes pretty quick. Uh, priming, ignites, yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch, oh yeah, switch and junctions. These are the interesting ones. Uh, as long as, as well as the Y. I haven't messed around with the Y track very much. Um, I'm not, I'm not very good at the Y track, and I'm not quite sure what it does. But uh, the switch cra switch track and junction track are really cool. Um, I don't need either one of them at the moment, but I may in the future. Um, right now, we're just doing some basic track, and with Railcraft, uh, they switched up the recipes a little bit. So you need some standard rail and some wooden rail beds. So the standard rail, you need the uh, the rolling machine, and it is shaped. Uh, I think there is actually rolling machine uh, shapeless, which is odd. Um, but you get uh, you need six iron or bronze, and it gives you. See, bronze only gives you six. Iron will give you eight. But if you use steel, you get sixteen. Pretty nice. This is actually what I use. I have a whole bunch of steel lying around. And then for the wooden rail bed, um, you need creosote buckets or bottles or whichever uh, and wood slabs so let me get some wood slabs cuz I uh, oh cool I have some already okay and I know I have some creosote there we go wooden tie there we go okay let me grab some wooden rail beds cool um yeah, I made a lot of these because I know I'm going to need them. So we need to do rail. Standard rail. So, 32. So two wooden rail beds gets you a full stack of track. So yeah, this stuff goes quite a long way for just regular track. Alright, that should be absolutely plenty. Uh, and then powered. Let me just put this away. What is powered? What does booster track look like? Oh yeah, you need the advanced rail, which is the standard rail, and then redstone and gold, and that gets you the advanced rail. Uh, and then just a piece of redstone. You only get 16, because these are pretty powerful. Uh, and that should be plenty. Alright, so let's go run some of this. Um, now I sort of want to start... Oh, actually, you know what? I need one more block. Well, yeah. Two more, really, but just one. I need the buffer stop track which is just a regular track plus a block of iron so hopefully I excellent All right. and you get 16 of these which is a lot trust me you need you don't need one at each end um, but it looks really cool alright so I'm gonna start right here uh, I think uh, you know what I don't know I don't want to make too many turns Oh, I, okay that'll work fine I can start right here. Everything will be cool. Um, 
whoops and there we go so this is the buffer stop um, it's just it it ensures that your minecart stops here um, eventually I'm gonna upgrade this setup a little bit and uh, have some better track uh, I might do that next episode or the episode after um, and then I don't know there's a lot of really cool stuff you can do with this and I'll probably come back and fix it and uh, you know improve it later but right now I just want to get this down just to make my life a little bit easier all right let's see um uh, there was another track that I wanted uh, oh yes 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 okay I remember um, Railcraft also adds this thing called uh, I think it's suspended track if I remember correctly let me see it's uh, this here suspended track yeah and this can cross up to um, oh I don't remember three three gaps is it I don't know let me grab oh no am I oh I need wooden okay I need just wooden ties uh oh Korea oh yeah that's right I have it in cans can I just get a stack of these oh I ran out of blanks that's not good that's okay uh, let me get three of them oh I'm out of rails Wow okay let me grab some more steel then yowza did not realize I was that low flip this bad boy on whoops alright and the awesome thing about the rolling machine is that it will auto magically um uh what is it called balance it'll automat auto magically balance whatever you put in it so if, as you saw if i take some out it'll automatically balance if i put it back in balance it bam awesome i love the rolling machine it's really cool um all right sorry about that Okay, it'll be fine. I'm not super worried about having more rail. I just wanted to make sure I, if I needed some in the future, I could lay some down. Okay, so let's start from here, and I'm just gonna start laying some track. Whoa, I've got I gotta go kind of slow. Now every um, uh, let's see, I think it's every eight, no, every eleven. Um, so we're gonna start out uh back here actually. Um, we're going to stay right here, right here. Uh, like I said, I'll probably, I will probably re-upgrade this, uh, pretty soon. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So every twelfth track, uh, so you have eleven in between. Every twelfth track should be a booster track. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 1. Okay, and then here is where the suspended track comes into play. Uh, if we... There we go. So you have to get it right on the edge. But if you sort of look and you do right, you can sort of see the box, and if you get it right on the edge, bam. Now, it should be able to just stay there. We can use regular track on each side. So this is really cool, but as I said, I think it only goes out so many spaces. Um, yeah, so you can only have two. Uh, oh, wow, it's only two. Okay. So yeah, it's a maximum of two spaces um, that you can suspend over. That's kind of dumb. I wish it was more than two, but again, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, uh, so I'm going to finish laying this track, and we'll be back. All 
Alright, and welcome back. So I just have this little bit of track laid. Oh, and I wanted to point out uh, one very important thing. Suspended track does not support uh, the player. So you will fall right through this. So if you're holding shift, you will stop at the block edge. And uh, you'll you'll fall through suspended track. But I have this little nice little thing laid. Uh, so I'm going to go get some, uh, some redstone torches. And I'm going to fix this. I'm going to light up all the uh, the booster tracks. Uh, let me actually go over here because I'll probably have to make a crap ton. Alright. This and red. Oh, maybe not. Cool. Alright. Yeah, for right now we're using redstone torches. Um... In the future, if I want to really be fancy with this, I will uh, find a better way to do it. But for the moment, I just need to get from point A to point B. Um, uh, yeah, this isn't quite 12. This is just something I do because I notice that corners, like one corner won't slow you down a lot, but like four or five, like back to back pretty quick, will. Uh, so I just, I always, um, the one before, or two before, I put a booster track, and two after curves, I put a booster track. Just, I don't know, something I do. I don't know why. It seems like a good idea to me. Alright. Then, oh, I haven't even made my mine card yet. Oh, crap. Alright. There we go. So, let me, uh, let me go make a mine card quick. Sorry. Thought I had one already. Actually, I might have one already. Yes, I do. Excellent. All right. Sweet. So I just do this and do this. Go push my way this way. There we go. So every twelve is not the absolute fastest you could be going. But it is a pretty good speed. Uh, I think the absolute fastest is every 8 or 9, I want to say. Um, but I like 12 because it's it's a little more efficient, and the speed is pretty close. So yeah, so the buffer stop track just ensures that the train stops. There we go. All right. uh, oh, I totally forgot about this. I, uh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So there's also a woven trackman's backpack, which, uh, I just had to pick up. Uh, there we go. Okay, sweet. I love backpacks so much. They're fantastic. Alright, so those are pretty much the basics. Um, yeah, I don't really need anything else. I'm not doing, like, crazy builds with this right now, today. Um, you know what? Let me... Let me check my time. I'm not sure. I didn't start my stopwatch again because I wasn't paying attention. Um, but let me check my time quick, and uh, we'll be back. All right, and welcome back. So um, we're at about 23, 24 minutes, something like that. So we're we're almost done. Uh, right now, I'm just trying to decide. So I got uh, my filler done. It worked. Everything's cool, and uh, all of this stuff. See, it's nice and flat and very, very nice. Um, so I'm probably gonna, I'm, I'll pull this bit down over here. Uh, this, uh, actually, this I'll probably leave alone. But this little hill right here, I'm gonna level that out. And I'm trying to decide if I want to uh, come over here and level some of this out too or not. I'm not sure how much space we're gonna need for uh, for what we're gonna do. So I think I'll just start with this right here, and then. Uh, I'll see what I'll see what Connor has in store uh but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Next episode I'm going to come back and take this uh this dinky little rail station, stinky little railroad and uh I'm going to come back I'm going to sort of level it out so I don't have to do all this crap. Uh, I'm going to go back through and uh, I'm going to take out these suspended tracks cuz they're nice. They're really cool actually. I I do like them like uh you know can bridge gaps and stuff, but, uh, nah, not really what I want. I want something that looks nice and streamlined and, uh, really professional. So I think I'm going to come back, I'm going to upgrade this, 
and uh, I'm going to use a couple of the other tracks from Whalecraft. If I could fix everything, a couple of the other tracks I'm going to use. Uh, let's see, mm, boarding track. I'm going to need some of those. Um. Uh, what else? I think that's about it. Uh, yeah, boarding track and holding track. This is, yeah. Probably. But, uh, yeah. So, we will see. And, uh, I don't know how much we're going to use this, but... Uh, I'm going to see how... How interesting I can make this. Uh, just for now. Uh, now, of course, there is sort of a problem, you know, if, uh... If two people are trying to use this at the same time, yeah, we might have a problem. So, uh, I'm going to sort of mess with that, and, uh, and we'll see how that does. But, for now, thanks for watching, and we'll make some more track next episode.